the Asian Apprenticeship Awards 2018 in association with the Royal Air Force. The Large Employer of the Year Awards 2018. Right, now moving on to the big boys. It's the Large Employer of the Year Award, sponsored by NOCN, a market-leading national awarding organization and government-approved endpoint assessment organization that has been creating opportunities for 30 years. There's a lot of people we could get up on the stage from that group, a lot of people. There's only one man for the job right now. That's this man right here. It's Graham Hastings Evans from NOCN. How are you, sweetheart? You all right? Lovely. Let's have a look at the nominees. The Large Employer of the Year finalists are Fortem, BAE Systems, BBC, Bombardier Transportation, BT, Dowling WLG, Jaguar Land Rover, KPMG, Mid Counties Cooperative, Morgan Sindel, Morrison's, NG Bailey, Warsaw Council, and Welcome Trust. Graham, some huge organizations there. Who's the winner? Uh, well, anybody that takes uh, an apprenticeship and is Asian is going to be a winner and anybody that employs them is going to be a winner but for the large employer award tonight it's the BBC <laughs> Well done. Congratulations. Well done. Well done. Uh, take your middle spot there. The British Broadcasting Corporation has been paving the way for apprenticeships for many years within the organisation, offering apprenticeships not only in the creative sector, but also in the professional sector. With social mobility top of the agenda, the BBC are reaching out to young people from diverse backgrounds to, co to coach and to train them into applying for an apprenticeship scheme with the BBC. <laughs> what? Ridiculous. Thank you very much. Well done, BBC. Congratulations, a wonderful, wonderful organisation. Congratulations. We are with, back with Mirjana, who you may have seen earlier on this evening, but alongside Mirjana, we have the employees as well, because we have a double whammy tonight, right? Absolutely. What's the, what's the reason for the celebration? Well, we've won two awards tonight. So Marjana's here as Legal Apprentice of the Year and the BBC are here as Large Employer of the Year. Fantastic. This is, what an achievement. It it's really is a double whammy, isn't it? Yeah, yeah. How does that make you feel as an employer? Because uh, we've heard from Marjana how she feels as an employee to have gained recognition for such a prestigious award. But as an employer to be recognised in this particular field, how does it feel? Well, we're proud of the work that the BBC does and we're very proud of our individuals, especially Marjana. Yeah. Excellent. <laughs> how did this all come about? What made you feel that the Asian Apprenticeship Awards was an event that deserved being nominated for or nominating Marjana for. Would you like to comment on that? Uh, well, Marjana um, has done fantastically since she joined the BBC. Um, I interviewed Marjana and she is very, very impressive. But once she's arrived at the BBC, she's actually taken the lead in changing our minds and how we run the apprenticeship. And uh, originally we had a level six apprenticeship. Yeah. And the first I heard of the level seven apprenticeship was from Majana. Wow. And uh, Majana challenged the organisation and said, why can't you do a level seven apprenticeship? It's much better. And we need those kind of people in the organisation that challenge our thinking and make us do things better. And if it wasn't for Majana, uh, I don't think we would be doing the Level 7 apprenticeship. Uh, and because of Majana, not only are we doing it, but all Majana's colleagues are benefiting from the Level 7 apprenticeship as well. So it's thanks to Majana that um, we've improved the apprenticeship at the BBC, uh, and that's why we're here tonight. Excellent. 
Excellent. Yeah. Fantastic. Well, you know what? There's congratulations all around. I think the uh, initiative Majana has shown is obviously filtered through the organization. You guys, as, organ as an organization, have picked that up and implemented it, which is also something to be uh, proud about because not all organizations tend to listen and then implement. So it's a two-way thing. And no doubt Majana will have her commitment with the BBC. And likewise, BBC are very proud to have Majana. So congratulations all around. So what's up for celebrations then? What are we, what are we having? For, are, we, are we invited? Am I in the report? Well, be at breakfast tomorrow morning. <laughs> All right. <laughs> fantastic. <laughs> but I'd like to say thank you for your hospitality. It's been a fantastic event and uh, the food has been amazing. The entertainment has been amazing. It's one of the best award shows, well organized award shows I've been to in a long time and um, the professionalism of the people here is fantastic. So I'd really like to thank everybody from the caterers to everyone who's been involved in organising this. You're most welcome. And it's been an honour to have you here with us. Uh, congratulations once again. Enjoy the rest of the evening. There's still some more to go. And uh, yeah, and some pudding. we still got the desserts left. So uh, enjoy the rest of your evening and I'm sure we'll see you around. Congratulations you once again. Much. Thank you. The Asian Apprenticeship Awards 2018 in association with the Royal Air Force.